Hello Channel Need viewers, I am DS, your psychologist and welcome to another episode on Channel Need. In this episode, we're going to explore how an ENTJ processes information. So I am very convinced as an ENTJ that I think very differently from most other MBTI types. There were a few occasions where I was put into a team of strangers for a team building event or the like and we were supposed to come up with some ideas or we were supposed to talk about and discuss some issues what actually happens is when other people start to give input I always have this feeling that they are not anchored Although the ENTJ is supposedly the commander and may assume a leadership position but usually in this kind of randomly formed groups like a team building event type of thing they might not take the initiative because we need more information and want to observe so there are other people who come in and take the leadership right so we let them be but a lot of times when the discussion unfolds I always think that it is going in the wrong direction so I will come in and share my point of view which is usually very different the team members are very taken aback they were like okay that makes sense but da 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 to further illustrate my point, I'm going to show a video here. This is a campaign by the Singapore Health Promotion Board. He's having a stroke. So the intent of this video is to highlight to the common person how to spot a potential stroke. Arm weakness. S. Speech difficulty. So I would say that this is rather informative. However, after watching this video, the first thought that comes into my mind is what if this person is a person who is living alone? Then he's left to die, is it? Of course, this video on its own is useful. But what if there are people who stay alone, like myself in the future? <laughs> so when an ENTJ processes information, they think a few layers up and then they are able to move very fast and project far into the future because TE plus NI is very future oriented. So this usually leaves people behind because we are really so forward in our thinking. And a lot of times, let's say, I see something that is different from the rest in a group discussion and I tell them, it throws them off guard. This is because the perspective of an EN teacher can be really very different and yet relevant. So recently I have been producing Mendo Pop videos so many of the viewers here you would have noticed so personally I see a huge potential in this Mendo Pop videos and I need to produce more because you need a collection of videos before they can take off so the first video is doing okay but the subsequent videos are not doing as well but I decided that I want to continue doing this so for those viewers who do not know what exactly this Mandel Pop charts are all about, it's generally a Chinese Mandarin version of Watch Mojo. Number three, baby one more time. So I have not really done research on this, but if I'm not wrong, I am the only person doing this kind of thing right now. And it's very niched. So when I share about this new Mandel Pop series that I have been doing with people that I know, their first reaction is wow isn't it good that you are the first person doing this i said yes that you have no competition i said no actually surprisingly i won competition the people are very surprised when they hear this so my perspective is when more people come up and do this then this ball can get rolling so personally i would very much like to have somebody else doing this so we can even collaborate i am always in for the win-win somehow the people around me always see things as win and lose it's either black or white for me i really think that there's a potential for this niche market and i really would like to have competitors the so the competition on its own can actually drive the vehicle much faster but from my sharing i realized that a lot of people don't see things the way i tend to see things in any case sidetrack a bit even though i would like to have competition i realized that it is very hard to have competition why because the mental pop series is really not easy to do first you have to be fluent in your mandarin i also realized that i'm not very competent in my mandarin now next you need to know a lot of songs 
So in the Singaporean context, unfortunately, I don't think that there are a lot of people who may be capable enough to do such a series. Unless they are ex-DJs. Yeah. So I'm really praying hard for somebody from Taiwan. Please do something like that and compete with me. <laughs> So fellow ENTJs, it is very understandable when we are talking to others that others may not understand us. They may be shocked by what we say. Why? This is because our Pentium, our modem, whatever the case is, is about three to four times faster than most people. So while other people are still taking down notes, what they should do or what to observe when they see certain symptoms in a person who might be potentially getting stroke, we have already moved on because we have skipped those little nitty gritty steps. This is also why it's very draining for us to talk to people who are slow to get us. So fellow ENTJs, do comment and share your experience. Okay, at Channel Need, we produce a lot of MBTI videos like this one, particularly ENTJ videos. If you have enjoyed, do give us a like. If you have not subscribed, do consider subscribing so that we can bring you more ENTJ and fun stuff. Okay, I am going to sign off now and I'll see you in our next episode. Bye bye.